Charlotte, where are you? The wedding ceremony has already started. Everyone's waiting for you. Why didn't you wake me up? I've been calling you dozens of times all morning. Charlotte, what's going on? Are, are you okay? Uh, I'll be right there. Dear friends and family, we're gathered here today to join Andrew Thompson and Charlotte Cooper in Holy Matrimony. Where have you been? Is everything okay? There's something I need to tell you. I... That's wrong, honey. Hey, we're about to be husband and wife. You tell me everything, you know that? I mean, come on, it can't be that bad. Andrew? I slept with someone last night. You cheated on me on our wedding day? I... I thought it was you. You disgust me. Go home. Wedding's canceled. last night wasn't Andrew. Someone had to have set me up. You ruined your engagement, whether it was your fault or not. You know how bad things are? You might have ruined the business deal with the Thompsons. I just lost my chance at lifelong happiness. And all you care about is a business deal. Don't get upset at Charlotte. I mean, she's still your daughter. She goes Enough. She's disgraced us for the last time. Charlotte, go get your things. Dad, what are you talking about? Don't call me that. The father-daughter relationship is over as of right now. Go get your things. Go. <laughs> Sir, I have reviewed the hotel security cameras, but it looks like someone wiped your floor's footage in between 11 p.m. and midnight. Are you trying to say that someone tried to set me up? What about the girl that came to my hotel room last night? Could have been her? We can't confirm if you were the target, sir. The eldest son of the Thompson family was having his bachelor party at the hotel. Some escorts came, and it could have been one of them. Oh, and Charlotte, I totally forgot to tell you something. It was all me, slut. Ness, what are you talking about? <laughs> Honestly, it was too easy. I just found a drunk stranger at the hotel bar, and then I stole his room card, and... Then I accidentally sent you to his room. <laughs> oh, I was just wondering if you liked your pre-wedding gift. How could you do this to me? Because I fell in love with Andrew. And you're a pain in the ass. Wait, let me out. <gasps> Over the years, I've been abroad until my father suddenly told me to come back half a month ago. Fortunately, I'm not alone anymore. Roman, how many times have I told you don't wander off without me? Sorry, Mommy. It's okay. I'm not trying to scold you. It's just dangerous wandering off without me, okay? Isn't this our home? This was my home. It's not anymore. You're my only family. Wherever you are, that's home. Will we still get to see Daddy this time? Then we could finally be a real family. If only I knew who he is. Let's go. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, ma'am. Thank you. Hey, what are you doing? We've been waiting here forever. You can't just cut in line. How much you want? Hmm? You want money? How much you want for the cap? 500 bucks? Hmm? Are you serious? You want a thousand? Here you go. Take the money and scram. Are you kidding me? Let me go. Don't disrespect me like that. That's my money. Daddy. I'm not your dad, kid. Okay? Get out of the way. Roman, come on, let's go. See you later, Dad. Go, please. 
I want you to find out as much as you can about that girl. Yes, sir. Hold that cab. Andrew? Charlotte, it's been a while. You've changed a lot. What are you doing here? I... Honey, who is it? Oh my God, Charlotte, you're here. Good, after all these years, you finally decided to show up. I missed you so much. Wait, who's the kid? Oh, you've gotta be joking. Don't tell me you got pregnant from that one night stand. Ugh, you gave birth to it? Ew. Watch it. If you say something like that again, I'll make you wish you were never born. Forget it, babe. Let's go back inside. <laughs> Wait. You two are... Oh, Daddy didn't tell you? And you and I are engaged. The wedding's this weekend. Congratulations. You two truly deserve each other. Is she here? Yes, Daddy. Well, we should get inside before Daddy gets mad. We wouldn't want that, right? Where did you bring him? Roman is my son. Of course I would take him with me. <laughs> She's right, Daddy. I mean, that is your grandson over there. I will never accept a bastard as my grandson. How could you say that? If you weren't going to welcome us, then why call us back here at all? This weekend is Vanessa and Andrew's engagement party. I also plan on announcing Vanessa as the new Cooper heir. I thought you should be here for that. But not with the child. Well, the next time something like this happens, just delete my number and save us both the time. Goodbye, and hopefully never see either of you again. Let's go, Mom. Charlotte Cooper, 30 years old, eldest daughter of the Cooper family. 10 years ago, her father, Bruce Cooper, kicked her out of the family because some sort of a scandal. I mean, she's been working as a fashion... Hold on, hold on. Did you just say that there was a scandal 10 years ago? Uh, yes, sir. The records show here that Charlotte Cooper left the country 10 years ago following a scandal that was exposed at Andrew Thompson's wedding. Let me see that. Uh, she's been abroad ever since. You know, there's something familiar about this girl. Wait, what? Nothing. Thank you, sir. Keep digging, I want to know what else you can find out about this girl. Shoot, I forgot to exchange money. I'm sorry, honey. This is all mommy has. Don't worry, mommy. It's enough. Mommy, the nice ice cream lady gave me an extra one. That's so sweet. Did you say thank you? Excuse me, mister, you dropped your ring. It's you! Did you steal it, you filthy brat? Andrew! No, I didn't. How could you say that? Roman didn't do anything. I think he knows it is hard whether he did it or not. You really have no shame, huh, Charlotte? Aren't you embarrassed dragging around this stealing <sighs> bastard with you everywhere? If you say that again, I swear. But did I call him wrong? I mean, it's true. He's nothing but a filthy <laughs> little bastard. <gasps> Are you out <gasps> of your damn mind? Oh, ah! oh my god! Barking and biting like a rabid dog? What kind of parent raises their child like that? Don't blame the kid. Raised without a father. No wonder he doesn't have any manners. <laughs> Honey! Hey! Hi, sweetheart! You alright? Huh? Hey, buddy! Hi, Daddy! You good? I'm sorry, guys. I had to take a phone call from the NBC reporter. Oh, my God. They just, just keep pestering me for an interview. Oh, blowing my mind. Uh, did I miss something? No, honey, they just wanted some money for the bus. Oh, no, guys, I'm so sorry. I, I don't have any money on me. But if you guys need a ride, we can 
take you for a ride in our new Porsche. <clears throat> Thank you so much. I'm Charlotte. Listen, I only did that because I don't like to see kids being pestering. Okay, but what kind of parent gives their kid only ice cream? And where's the kid's father? I mean, what kind of father leaves their kid with someone like you? Are you serious? Are you really gonna treat somebody like that that just saved your life? I'm grateful for your help, but no one tells me how to raise my son. Let's go, Roman. <laughs> All right, we'll see you. Don't, don't worry. All right, yeah. fine. Yeah. Stop. Oh, oh. Stop. <laughs> Luckily, I still have one last refuge in this world. Oh, oh my God, Charlotte, my sweetheart. Hi. Where have you been? Oh. Hi, I'm Roman. Hey, Roman, sweetie, so good to see you. You guys, come on in. So good to have you back. You need a wing. Here you go. Oh, so how's he doing in school? Amazing, he's great. Good. As always. Slow down, child. <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go outside. Oh, okay. All right. Mm. Thank you so much for all of this. <laughs> Honey, I'm your godmother. I should be conjuring up glass slippers and pumpkin carriages for you. <laughs> oh, you know what, that reminds me. Wait here a moment. So, I heard about Andrew and Vanessa's engagement party this weekend. I'd really rather not go. I think I just want to cut off all contact with them. Charlotte, living well is the best revenge. And those who wish ill upon you, that's the right thing. Thank you. you know what? Open the box and give them a sight to behold. <laughs> You're going to be beautiful. You see that girl over there in the purple? Don't let her in. Excuse me, ma'am. May I see your invitation, ma'am? What invitation? I'm sorry. No invitation. You can enter, ma'am. Listen, I didn't even want to come here tonight. Your host is the one that invited me. And if he doesn't see me, it's going to be a big problem for you. Rules are rules. No invitation, no entry. <clears throat> Daddy! Huh? Um, I didn't expect to see you here. Well, I was invited. Um, we forgot our invitation. Um, do you think you could help us in? Of course. But, uh, you're gonna have to beg me. <laughs> <laughs> 